Hello everyone, welcome back to BIMmodeler.com. BIMmodeler.com is a place where you can download your BIM contents and you will be able to learn your uh, BIM or related to Revit, Navisoc and Dynamo related softwares. So we provide service also for uh, different companies for their BIM model creations, architecture or MEP uh, models or we work with uh, manufacturer to create their product as a BIM component or BIM object. So uh, let's uh, dive into this current tutorial. So like have you ever wanted uh, under collaborate tab what is shared view? So have you used it? If you know uh, if you have used it already and uh, there is a simple option uh, which is there. Have you used that option? You let me know. So we very often this uh, we use this option to share it the project or family with the uh, the client so that the client can uh, view it without rivet. They can view this option and view the model and they can command it and come back to us or what are the revisions they wanted to make it in the model. So with this, uh, let's click this option. So you have to be in signed in uh, in your license. So you will be able to have this option. So new shared view, uh, you have to give your name for the view like 3D view. This is the project for sample project. So I'm giving the sample project one. If I click share, it will take some time to process it. You have to remember that this model must be saved before doing this option and you have to have a proper license to do this exercise. But this is a wonderful option for a client to view it without revert and they can command it online. That is the main point actually. Uh, the thing that it will take some time to process and upload the model to online. And uh, do remember, uh, if a client just want to see it, they can view it without logging into the browser uh, using the Autodesk IDs. Uh, if a client, they wanted to command and if you want to see it back, so then they have to log in in Autodesk and they don't have to have any license for it. Just they have to log in uh, and uh, sign up and register as usual. And once it is done, they will be able to uh, come back and uh, log in and they can command in the 3D view. Now you can see that uh, you can see it in the browser or you can copy and paste the link in your mail or WhatsApp, whatever the place that you want. So in this case, I'm just clicking the view in browser option. So automatically browser opens and you can see the same option available here in this place. Um, you can see it clearly that new view is created. And you can reference, uh, I believe this is uh, for 30 days and after 30 days it will be expired because it's a temporary Autodesk giving you free of cost for this and uh, it will be deleted later time. So they cannot keep it for their server longer time. So this is how you'll be able to see it. You can click this and you can see that add command. Uh, you will be able to see add command option automatically it takes to the viewer. So you can go and here and you can see that it's coming and I can close it. I can sign in into my Autodesk account. And once we are signed in, similar way the client also can sign in and they can view this model and they can rotate it, interact with the model. There are many options available in here and in here. So you can go one by one views. I have uploaded only one 3D views, model browser. You can see that there are many models floor and different walls and uh, different equipments, uh, windows, doors are available. So the model browser will help us to uh, navigate in place uh, where you want to go and let let it load let me select one of the object and you can see the property here and let's come back to the commands now if you see that this is the uh, once if i click the uh, command wherever i zoom in zoom out 
like this and it automatically takes snap and view option move window 500 millimeter I can post it as a client if they are doing it and similarly this command will be addressed in the, with the timestamp and with the uh, with the place that they have marked it so I can command it second time like this so it will be recorded like this and I can come back uh, the model browser is not working since it's a limited version it will not be working and a screenshot if you want you can take and send it as in WhatsApp or wherever the place that you want it so this is the main purpose actually so you can view it like this and you can explore the model and you can fit it in pan in the model zoom it in out so these are the normal command by default orbit will be there first person so you can interact it with the, as a first person so let me orbit it even you can do the measurement tool from where to where so it will show you the um, dimensions these are the self explanatory options available and the section which is a way that I love the most so you can see that you can make it up and down and you can zoom in the place and uh, even you can take the box uh, as like in rivet there is a box option available and you can move the box itself to the place where you want it and now you can command it based on the uh, available view it will be taken as a snap to the later stage so once it's done clear and you can do the explode model this is again wonderful option to see what are the geometries available and how it's modeled together putting it together uh, while exploring if you want to give the command with the markup you can do it and you can mark it whatever the command that you wanted and uh, you can save it and you will be able to see those in the command so once it is done you can export it and you can send it as a file so you can see that it will be downloaded here as PDF like this or you can go back to Revit you can refresh it and you can see that the commands are appearing in this place so this is how uh, for example in this case and I want to go here and it will go and take you to the place where it is done so this is how you will be able to use the shared view very productively uh, for your user or your client can use it very well uh, without they don't have to have Revit software to view the um, model or family that you have created this is how we are using it uh, the clients are amazed with the uh, viewer experience because they just need to have a browser so do let me know uh, if you have any questions related to this you can leave a comment or uh, if you have any projects requirement uh, you can share it with us uh, raj at bimmodel.com so happy to be working with you uh, uh, if it helps let me know give a thumbs up and see you on the next tutorial Ta -ta. bye bye